So we are replacing the fuse box in the Suzuki XL7 and what we did was we first removed this cable here. This is connected to the battery and then right here and right here on the box this just clips into the box so all you have to do is pull this in on this side and also pull it in on the back side and just pull it in and then you have somebody help you pull it out and once you pull it out it looks like that on the base and then underneath the uh, fuse box it looks like and that's what it looks like on the underside so now all we need to do is remove these wires and then uh, connect them to the new fuse box it's very quick and easy now I've never done this before but I think these wires are being held in by this right here so oh yeah you just push that in on both sides and see it comes right out Ta -da! so this is the new fuse box and we need to just connect those same wires right here and then seat it back in the base and that's it oh and you can't can't put this in wrong because the prongs underneath are different so there's only one way to put this in and that's that way Okay. Okay. Okay, see here these feet coming off the bottom. You have to match them up with the feet inside, see? Okay. There. And then you have to push down so all the connections are together. Then see these um, connectors here? They were down inside. And we pulled this out and this out and popped them up. Okay, we popped them up so they're not down inside of here anymore. We popped them up so that way they can connect to the um, to the new fuse box. All right. So now, after we pop up these white interconnectors, we're now trying to line it up, and then you should hear it snap into place. See, I think it goes, see right there, there's a little, see this right here, this little black thing, it goes inside of that little connector there. You see this connector? I'm going to pull it out again. Okay, see it's all the way out now. See that little black thing? It goes into the little arm of the connector and pushes it, connects to it. And then pushes it down. See? Okay. Okay, then when you push it down, put your thumb here, right here, and push down, and then you'll hear it click into place right here. Now, I didn't hear the back connector click into place that's right there see it right there so I'm gonna put my thumb here and push down I didn't hear it click did it click I don't know did 
Did you hear it click? This is what I'm showing you how this part is out. See how this part is in? So I'm going to um, push that back and pop it up. So that's what it looks like now that it's popped up. So now this part clicked into place holding the fuse box down and the back clicked into place holding the fuse box down and it's important that you put you put it over you put the new fuse box over the base and you push both the back and the front together at the same time so they snap into place together okay then just put this cable back on okay now reconnecting the battery